Now, I'm no dog. As we all know here, it's a good old Southern boy. But correct me if I'm wrong, I keep hearing this word trauma, and nothing about you handling our homosexual situation we're dealing with. But my sister, God bless her soul, got a little fruit of a child herself, and she done raised him up right. There ain't no trauma in his life. Hand to the Bible. Senator, this study would be beyond sexuality other than in cases of traumatic-based sexual programming. Its primary purposes would be an attempt to unlock a patient's darkest memories, to free them from the prison such moments create sexual or not. But we did hire and bring you on down here as our leading sexual disorder doctor. This is correct, is it not? Yes, Senator, but if I may interject, Senator, let me put this in more basic terms. Thank you, Doctor. That would be much appreciated. Dr. Strauss here has personal issues with our treatment process due to the traumatic experience of his brother's lobotomization during his youth, and that has nothing to do with the current situation, and frankly, it's none of your damn blue. I'm painting the full picture here. Like I was saying, Dr. Strauss is looking for taxpayer funding to test psychedelic drugs on patients to alter people's minds. What we would like to call new science and more broad spectrum than the current homosexual issues you were referring to. Well, in that case, I believe I can speak firmly on behalf of my constituents uh, that we would like your focus to remain on these important issues. Uh, with that, I motion to deny funding. But if you give me a moment to... Hi, I'm Duffy Austin. I'm from New Orleans, Louisiana. Self-represented, non-union, five foot six inches tall, and 135 pounds.